Bob Probert's coffin arrived in bad boy style, but number 24 wasn't your typical bad boy. Oh, he stands out as just a, a, a great guy, um, f funny guy, big, lovable teddy bear. Because he was such a good guy and a likable guy, but he kind of he played with an integrity and, and an honor in that you know, in that position. Probert burst onto the NHL scene in 1985 with the Detroit Red Wings. And when you're from Windsor, that's the home team. He scored goals. He also protected the superstars like Steve Iserman, who gave today's eulogy. But Probert's battles on the ice were small compared to the ones he fought off the ice. At one point, he was caught smuggling cocaine across the Windsor-Detroit border. He ended up in jail, then in and out of rehab. Somehow, the man who was born to scrap fought his way out. This is uh, my punishment for what I've done, and, and uh, you know, I uh, respect the judge's decision, and I just want to get it behind me and uh, get on with my life. He owned up to his actions and I'm opened up to kids about his problems. Because, um, if you haven't used or experimented with drugs, don't. Probert was a complicated man with a complicated life, but Windsorites always forgave him. Good or bad, up or down, he was theirs. He was a regular guy. He wasn't, uh, uh, he, didn't, he didn't act like, you know, a celebrity or he, he was no different than you and I on the street. You know, when he ran right into him, he said hi. He, if you asked him for an autograph and he was in the middle of his beans and franks in a restaurant, he would stop, put his fork down and make sure you got an autograph. And today across the city, it was obvious the player who fought so hard and gave so much will never be forgotten. This has been sitting up in, in a closet for a long time, never come out, and I figured today would be the perfect day to bring it out. Though he died so young, friends say Bob Probert died clean and sober. He'd become a family man, and finally, he'd become a happy man. Susan Pedler, CBC News, Windsor, Ontario.